and his family arrived to hear whether an inquest would go ahead nearly five years after her death in Cape Town. One month ago, they had asked the coroner to pass on a list of questions to Sri Andwani. In court, they were given his response, a two-page letter. The Hindocha's family lawyer indicated Shrian said an inquest into Annie's death would serve no purpose. After the proceedings, the Hindocha family declined to say what he had written to them. Those, no, those questions were not also responded in South Africa. Uh, and those are the questions we need to we can move on with our lives. Uh, now we'll have to go on another battle, whatever it is. I can't talk about it at this point, but this battle is not over. We need, we need the answers. Did Shreya Dewani's letter offer you any comfort? Did he offer his sympathies? Or I mean, it, it's two pages. It, what did he say? All I can say is we felt the other way around. And the Hindochas spoke again about options they would pursue. We got a few more options left. Uh, we're going to look through all of these options and uh, go ahead with it in near time. These are the 37 detailed questions that the Hindochas sent Sri Dewani. His response, a two-page reply, which the Hindochas said was far from satisfactory. They have hinted they have other legal options, but would not give details. Catherine Drew, SCBC News, London.